Hello YouTube, this is Rokokami and this is the Beast Build. So, we've been kind of on a hiatus for a while, haven't gotten much done. We had to store some new toys in here that we built. Sorry, I couldn't upload the video. Had some uh, problems with YouTube. It wouldn't work. But uh, not a big deal. So I started uh, chopping out the wires. Wires that I knew we don't need. So the wires we don't need don't lead anywhere. Wires we do need happen to be in this convenient little bundle wrapped up for us. It's really nice. Makes everything so much easier. However, we have to remove everything to get the last of these wires out so that we know when we're driving down the road, something's not going to short out and start a fire. But if you watched my other videos, you would notice. Me saying stuff like, man, there's just a fuckload of wires in here. Just so many. Well, we now have the actual calculation for a fuckload of wires. And that is five and a half miles. Of wire, all different colors, sizes, you name it, we got it here. Just from one van. And that's mostly because there were so many little things in here that they put on as extras. There was five different places for 12 volt outlets five of them now, i don't know about you but 10 plugins that's a little redundant a little redonkulous you don't need that many i mean unless you got a family of like 40 come on well I chopped up all the wires and was running through and found the most heinous of all plugs. One that requires the most dainty of fingers with the finger strength of Hulk. Yeah, it's... Ugh. They need to make a freaking adapter that you can push on there and just pull the plug off. But, whatever. Now we got more wires underneath the dash that need to go because they don't need to be here. And then we got to run wires for the speakers. So, I'm going to save all of this wiring. Not that I need to because I got plenty of speaker wire. But I'm going to save all of this extra wire. And it's going right back in as speaker wire. Now we're going to have to chop them. Chop that back end. Which means we have to take the lights and the wires for the lights out. But I don't have the tools for that right now. So that's got to wait still. A little bit annoying, but whatever. Now, without all them wires, this actually looks pretty decent. I mean, sure, yeah, if, if this wasn't like the family style one, they would have hid all the wires and everything underneath a false floorboard. But... 
honestly, I don't really care. So I think this, gotta get rid of them hoses because they don't run to nothing no more. But basically out of this project, I figure I'm going to have leftovers for like three or four different builds. It's going to be nice. So just wanted to send an update to you guys and say, hey, we got this from Mac. It's a cherry picker. And behind it's an engine stand. We built that yesterday. Couldn't upload that video once again, but it's all right. Well, this is Roku Kami signing off. We'll see you later.